Oh, welcome back, everybody. I'm glad you guys are joining me today and getting some terrible news out of North Carolina and other places around the Appalachian area where they are still suffering from the effects of Hurricane Helena as it went in and absolutely devastated the the area that it landed in. Absolutely terrible. Now we're seeing and we're hearing these stories of FEMA, a government pr uh, assistance pr uh, department uh, headed by Kamala Harris and Joe Biden is now screwing the people of these areas. Absolutely disgraceful. Obviously, FEMA had given a big budget part of their money uh, toward uh, illegal aliens in the country. Um, and now, all of a sudden, does not have enough money to help actual citizens of this country. And even worse, they are now stealing supplies that are coming in for those people. And this is being broken by Elon Musk over here on X. Let's go ahead and take a look at this story because this is huge. Elon's out there trying to provide assistance, uh, trying to provide star links and ways for people to be able to communicate because we know cell towers and things like that have been impacted all over that region. People are having a hard time getting hold of family and friends in those areas, which is making rescue even harder to know exactly uh, who needs rescuing. And so here's Elon trying to uh, assist and they're gaining pushback and actually gaining intel on what's happening on the ground there. Let's take a look at the story uh, over here on X. Uh, from Elon Musk says, just received this note from SpaceX, en SpaceX engineer helping on the ground in North Carolina at FEMA. It's not merely failing to adequately help people in trouble, but they're actively blocking citizens who tried to help. Hey, Elon, update here on the side of Asheville, North Carolina. We have powered up two large operating bases for choppers to deliver goods into the hands. We've deployed over 300 plus Starlinks and the outpour is it has saved many lives. The big issue is FEMA is actively blocking shipments and seizing goods and services locally and locking them away to state they are their own. It is very real and scary how much they have taken control to stop people helping. We are blocking. We are blocked now on the shipments and of new Starlings coming in until we have, until we get an escort from the fire department. But that may not be enough, he says. Uh, so yeah, who does the, uh, yeah, who oversees FEMA? The same guy who oversees the border. Yeah, we know uh, how that's tearing turning out right now, and it's terrible for the uh, uh, for the people that are suffering in that area. I know how devastating hurricanes could be. Obviously, we were it's ground zero for Hurricane Helena that happened here. Absolutely just destroyed surrounding communities around us. Um, even my uh, town that I live in has sustained major damage. Um, however, uh, we are not having the same issue here with some of the FEMA and government assistance, but a lot of that is being headed by the state, uh, headed by Ron DeSantis' its government here in the state of Florida, and we have not had the same type of issues that we are now seeing happening in other states in the Appalachian area. Uh, so again, let me know what you guys uh, see happening out there. If you are in those areas um, and any other stories that you might be coming across, because I know one of the stories that I reported on a couple of days ago was a helicopter pilot from South Carolina trying to come in and help rescue people was turned away and threatened to be arrested. Uh, this is not the way uh, Americans normally come together to try to help each other. And now we have the government actively working against its own citizens. Um, this is very troubling. Indeed, people need to be fired. Uh, they actually may need to go the extra step and start arresting the federal workers that are there. Uh, it's extreme, but the state has its right to do that. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Of course, you guys follow me on all my social media, all linked in the description down below. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Have a great, great day.